All right, guys, welcome back to another episode here on the Pixelmon Revolution server. Last episode, we had our very first tournament, and if you didn't see, uh, you should totally go watch that video. It's a long one, but it's definitely worth the watch. We got first place. We are the current champions here on the server, um, but we have had to retire that tournament team and, you know, turn to our, our good old boys right here. Uh, for the time being and i thought that this episode we could do a little bit of work uh laying out the rest of our town so i want to put a pathway through here and i want to have it come around maybe bridge across uh and connect up right down here i want to do more work on the river that you just saw bring it down here uh do a bunch of work right here i want to build uh at least the layout kind of get an idea of our gym which is going to be going right there um, and then we could probably plot out a couple more buildings and stuff like that. But the other big thing I need to work on is we need to put together another tournament team. Um, someone came up with the idea of doing little informal tournaments between our big ones. So uh, I'm hosting a small tournament. It's just a type tournament. Um, if you haven't read it, members, that if you haven't read it but you're watching the video or for the audience, essentially, uh, you have to. Have, it's one type. So your team has to be all one type. You can have dual typing, but one of them has to share that common type. So for example, we're going to do a fighting team, and I'm going to be using our Lucario. <laughs> so he's fighting Steel, uh, and that's fine, as long as he's got the fighting type. The max level is level 45. We can't use any Pokemon obtainable over level 45 that you could get through Ditto Breeding, so I can't use, like, como -O or anything like that. Um... Because you get him like past level 45. He is a really good fighting type though. Uh, what I want to work on is getting at least another one of our Pokemon uh, all bred up for that. I don't want to, you know, reveal anything else. There's only four Pokemon. So if I, you know, show the Lucario and then one other, that's already 50% of our team. So don't want to show much more than that. And I've actually never seen one of the Dreadnoughts spawn here. I'm going to try and catch this guy. That was easy. Anyways, so we have our Lucario right here, and I think another good fighting type to put on it, and a fighting type that we actually have on our gym team, that's why I'm doing this, because then I could use these guys for my gym. Um, we're going to be using a Conkelder, so I think I should work on getting him. He is the most powerful fighting type in the game, I believe, uh, is what, is what Smogon says. It's like the number one fighting type, but he's just base fighting, so he's weak to psychic and flying, and I think that's it um but yeah he would make a good addition to the team so i need to find us a timber and uh do some breeding but while i'm doing that i'm also gonna lay out some of this area and i'll come back once we've made some progress on either of those tasks all right guys so since the last clip i've done quite a bit of work both on our breeding a timber and on our river so check this out i kind of changed the shape of it i made it come further out this way before jutting over uh, so we'd have more room for our gym um, we're not gonna have a bridge go across it right here we may have a bridge go across it right here but I'm not sure yet we'll just have to see how it lays out because we can get to the entrance of the gym by going here and then kind of you know walk a path around here might put like a flower garden in here and then boom gym right here so yeah uh, I like that I've also started to work on this place a bit and instead of putting the informal tournament in the next episode, it's a pretty small tournament. I think I'm just going to tack it on uh, just a little informal tournament. There probably won't be more than six people. So I think I'm just going to tack it on to the end of this tournament, uh, to the end of this video, I mean. So I can go on ahead and discuss the entire team. So let's get back over here to our base. Uh, so our team, as stated in... The previous clip is going to be Lucario and Conkelder. We've got those confirmed. And I already have our third guy finished. Well, technically our second guy. Because I got him done before Conkelder. Infernape. Uh, I got this guy ready for our gym. Uh, I left him at level 40 in case I wanted to use him for a tournament. So I'll, I'll bring him up to level 45. Same with Lucario. But we're going to be using Infernape. And then Conkelder. And then our fourth guy... I thought about Breloom, I thought about Halucha, I thought about a lot of good fighting types. Uh, Crabominable, because it's an ice type, but I decided on Scrafty, because Scrafty can cover our psychic weakness. Now, uh, Conkelder can learn Rock Throw, which covers flying, and Scrafty can learn like Crunch and stuff like that, which will cover the psychic weakness, hopefully. I believe 
I believe that covers psychic. Um, but yeah, so that will be good. Uh, pleased with that. So that's going to be our team, and I guess we can go on ahead and take a look at how the breeding's going. Uh, it's coming along nicely. Right here, we've got... This guy's our best guy, probably, because he's 31 attack, 31 HP, and 28 defense. Now, all I care about him getting is the 31 special defense, or a high special defense stat. So, if I can get an offspring with f these four, then I'm good. Uh, we don't care about special attack, and we don't care about speed, because he's super slow. He only has 45 base speed. Um, so, yeah, definitely don't want to worry about speed. And then we will EV train him for attack. And, I don't know, probably HP. I'll have to see what Smogon says. But, yeah. Maybe special defense, because his defense is really high. But I am going to throw an Assault Vest on him. He's not going to use any status moves. And an Assault Vest is going to increase his special defense by 50%. That's pretty crazy. So, if he's got 65 special defense, it's going to make it 90... 97 and a half, I think. Something like that. So... I thought a good thing to put in our town that we could actually use later this episode would be a training field. A se separate from the gym, we could put a little fun practice training field out in this uh, open area out here that is going to be a part of the town. You know, I just haven't plotted out any buildings yet. Um, but I thought we could put a training field probably right here in this spot. So just like a rough looking like coarse dirt, couple like wooden scaffold looking platforms. Um, I thought that'd be cool, and we could host the tournament right here in our dojo town, and it'd be a nice little area to do it. I also want to finish this nether portal tower entrance. Uh, I want to get a bridge built here, uh, probably one right here, so we will see about that, and probably even one right there. A lot of bridges coming out from this puppy right here. And I also want to try and, you know, work on this river as much as we can. At least get this part done right here through here. Uh, we may omit doing this part for now but if i can get it all the way done through here that would be pretty good because that's no one's really going to go over there that much probably um so if we can hope we could probably hold off on that and just focus on getting it down through here and then it's going to let out into the river right here so i could actually dig this out and there'll be a little waterfall right here because our water is on this elevation so, I'm going to hopefully go catch a few Scrafties and continue working here. I'm going to work on the river a bit, and then I'll come back when we've got a bit more progress. Alright, so I actually, I said I wouldn't do this roundabout in the last clip, but I ended up doing it. So, I got water through all of here, and I've decorated it up all through here. Uh, I've kind of like marked out something right there, uh, but ignore that for now, it's not important for this episode. Um, we also brought it all the way down through here, added the leaves, and we've got it flowing off into the river right here. Looks very nice, uh, adds a lot. Let's look at it from the map. Look at this. Wow. It's just honestly crazy. I'm a madman. But right here, I want to have a practice field. We want to have a bridge right here, and then the, a path will come this way, and a bridge right here, and then we will have another bridge right there. So... That is the plan. Uh, no bridge here. Uh, you'll have to go that way, that way, and around uh, in order to get over there. I kind of like that, uh, that this is a natural barrier. Uh, it kind of breaks the town up, makes you walk through the town. Uh, it's kind of the idea behind it. Um, but yeah, so this will just have a bridge right here and nothing else that, you know, you can get to it because that's like a little landmass behind it. Um, but we still need to build this. But I thought we could do this. Um, essentially, I've kind of marked this out. I just want to, like put down a bunch of coarse dirt and the idea is we're gonna put in here watch this we'll put in like some grass and some random spots and that looks not bad um and we will taper the edges a little bit we'll throw some grass in here put some more in here till it till it or not till it but make it path um do stuff like this in here We've got little platforms right here that I will make, probably out of wood, but maybe out of stone. I want to have a fence that goes kind of along the back edge, and maybe we'll come around to, like, here or something. Or maybe just the back edge. Not sure yet. Um, and then a Pokeball sign right here. Uh, I might even leave it made out of cobblestone like this, because uh, it looks, like, pretty rough and stuff. Uh, but I may change it. Uh, to path blocks or something else, but this is kind of the idea of what we're going for. I just want like a rough looking 
playing field. So I'm gonna get this done real quick and I'll come back and show you guys what it looks like. All right guys, I've been working and I just finished up our arena here. It looks very rough. I kind of like how it looks. Uh, we've got these two platforms as well as bleachers, two healers, two PCs. Uh, I like the aesthetic of it and you, you can still tell there's like a Pokeball right there and like, you know, stones and stuff. Like it looks like, I tried to make it look almost like, like kind of like one of the rougher like rock type gym arenas from the actual anime or the games. Uh, I like it. I think it will do as a little quote unquote practice field. Um, and this is where we will be hosting the tournament, uh, which is tomorrow. Um, another thing is I've got our last Pokemon right here, Scraggy. Let's check him out. IVS4. He's got 74% IVs. It's not great. It's not terrible. Um, speed is the lowest one. And I don't care much about speed on this guy because let's look at his stats. His speed, well, I guess this doesn't show it. He's got a Jolly Nature, was it, which isn't good, really. We want, like, minus special attack, plus attack, or plus HP, or plus defense. Something like that um, on Scrafty, uh, but it's okay. He also doesn't have the ability I want on him. He's got Shed Skin instead of Moxie. It's not terrible for this tournament, because if he gets poisoned or something, he might shed that uh, effect off of so not bad, but not great. Moxie makes it to where his attack increases every single time he KOs a Pokemon. Uh, so that can be really damaging uh, if you get one or two of those. We also have Girder, Infernape, and Lucario all leveled up to level 45 and locked. I'm going to put... Um, I'm not sure what I'm going to put. I think a Dark EMZ on this guy as his item. Uh, I just got a Lucky Egg on him right now because we're about to train him up. And I'm going to EV train him for HP and special defense so that is the last thing i have to do to get ready for the tournament um we know our lucario's moveset is pretty good because we've used him before uh really not happy with anyone else's moveset uh but it's just an impromptu tournament it's not supposed to be super competitive so we haven't put that much time into these guys and that's completely okay when it comes down to our gym team i'll probably use these guys to breed better guys um, and then retire them to our PC and our Tournament Hall of Fame box. It is very likely that, I, that the next clip you see will be uh, the tournament, so wish me luck, guys. <laughs> I think I'm really going to need it because you've got Tasty Bacon and Wyatt in this tournament, and I didn't even have to fight them last tournament, so uh, I think it'll be a little difficult, but I'm looking forward to the challenge. Welcome, everybody. This is the first uh, informal tournament that we are having for anybody unaware the rules are pretty simple uh, all your Pokemon have to share one typing uh, the max level is 45 mega Pokemon are allowed Z crystals are allowed and I think that is uh, the basics of the rules um, is everybody ready to get started I forgot Megas were allowed oh <laughs> no tasty <laughs> um, so we're going to be doing this pretty much like the start of the other tournament we're each just going to fight each other if there's a tiebreaker then we will do a bracket but since there's no groups there's no need to do a like an actual bracket unless there is going to be a tiebreaker at the end so Trin will probably be joining us here in a few minutes but we can go ahead and do some of these other battles while we're waiting on her so who wants to go first I mean, Wyatt and Z are already on the battlefield. So. Yeah, I guess that's right. <laughs> Wyatt and Z. <laughs> you two go ahead. All right. You, you ready, Tasty? Uh, I am as ready as I'll ever be. All right. Oh, boy. Ooh, that's a, <laughs> is that a fighting type? Water fighting? No. Water dark? No, it is not. Something. <laughs> Not gonna tell you. <laughs> we have a trespasser on the field. Yeah, we have a very annoying center. <laughs> I took care oh. of him. <laughs> oh man. <laughs> Oop. <laughs> uh, I forgot what it's. <laughs> oh, he's got a dark type team. Oh no. <laughs> oh oh no. man. Uh, that sucks. Yeah. Alright, that's pretty good. Ah, there you go. <laughs> um... I'll be right back. I'm so surprised right. I outsped him. Yeah, isn't he normally really slow? Yeah, he has 50 base speed. Or 45 base speed, I think. 
pretty terrible. Oh, this is the guy before Tyranitar, right? You got an evil light on him? Maybe. Maybe. <laughs> oh. I... Okay. Nice. Nice. Okay. <laughs> You'd think he wouldn't be able to do much damage in that farm. Pretty sure you're weak to this. I don't even have a mega evolution. <laughs> I'm trying. I would have. I the the Pupitar only evolves into a Tyranitar like level fifty four, I think. So yeah. I couldn't get it. Couldn't get Tyranitar, and that's what would have been my mega evolution, I think, in my original plan. But yeah, maybe the next official tournament, the it'll be like fifty five or something, you know, so we could at least get some of the really good stuff. I don't. I don't mind. I don't. I don't mind. I just have a bad that time match up here. That that happens. <laughs> yeah. Oh, that's that's yeah. Oh, did I miss? Yeah, but I I clicked the wrong move, so. <laughs> <laughs> it still did damage, you know. Oh, it doesn't affect. Wait, what? <laughs> you have an air balloon. <laughs> we. <laughs> <laughs> oh man. Okay. Yeah, there we go. GG's. <laughs> to be honest, for the bad time matchup I had, I didn't. I don't even think I did it that, that bad. That was not. That was not bad. <laughs> I wasted. I wasted two turns on that air balloon. I messed that up real good. Against Trin. Okay. Mm -hmm. What's well, Conkeldur's second typing? Is it rock nope? Round? Just fighting. Oh, it's just fighting. Actually, it looks I, like it should be rock though. Yeah. I, I have my mic muted and didn't notice. Oh! Oh my God! Is that it? I should know what good what's good against this guy. I've got one, but I don't know. <laughs> He's fighting type. I know that. Nice, nice. I know this will probably be a one hit. <laughs> Ice punch. Oh, he held on. That, that that's good. We got an air balloon on him. That's smart. He's in the ice punch. I don't I don't know much about this guy. But you know, ice punch. Yeah. Yeah. Whatever. Yeah. Cut time. <laughs> I knew I wasn't going to be very well prepared for this, and that's fine. My my toga kiss is generally, genuinely, uh, pretty beefy though. It's it's doing quite well so far. So, I'll fight you, Dash. Come on, uh -huh. let's go. <laughs> no, why? Why? That's all for Titans. <laughs> Ready? After after this one, me and Trill could fight. Mm. Oh, okay. That works. Reflect. That's good. Oh, no! <laughs> Don't avoid! No! Oh, the spectate command still doesn't work? Yeah, I just gotta walk up to him. There we go. Alright, that's not bad. Oh! Man, that hurt. This should kill. Sleep. Oh, I didn't. Oh, that might be a mistake. Sleep. <laughs> Infinite for flaming hair looks so weird at Pixel Ball. Oh, no. <laughs> This Toki Kiss is. It's a really good competitive Jeez. Pokemon. Jeez. Yeah, it's a beast. There we go. <laughs> Lucario sounds like there's just like some old woman that has been smoking way too much <laughs> in her throat. Yeah. <laughs> oh, come on. 
Oh, so oh what? Steel type. Oh. Well, I wish I had thought about that beforehand. <laughs> All right, I feel safe now. Now we're e we're even again. <laughs> Cancel yeah, there's, that. this isn't gonna end up well for me. This is still the best move I got towards him. I don't actually know what to do here. Oh, that. <laughs> do a barrel roll. <laughs> nice. All right, this is my last guy. At least our screens didn't just flip when I said that. <laughs> oh, man, you outspent me. Mm, it says Mega. This is over. We'll see. I've never had a Mega last more than one turn. Well, well you definitely outspeed my guy. He's super slow. Good, good game. Good job. All right. We're just starting out against Z. I believe this should do a bit of damage. No. I, d I just saw the nickname on him. Oh, you just yeah. did that, didn't you? <laughs> yeah, I yeah. just did it. Because <laughs> he seems to be destroying everyone. Yeah. What? Sorry. She. It's a girl. Like it grass. Oh, I, I got just a thing. Oh, too late. <laughs> No, it's fairy grass, right? Yeah, fairy grass. Yeah, I keep thinking it's psychic as well. But... Yeah, that's what I thought. A psychic would shred my team. But technically fairy would too. I I almost did oh, two there fairy we go. grass types. I got, but got the steel type move on I decided on not to. Nice Oof. punch. Yep. Yikes. Four times effective, I think. Three times effective here. No. Oh. How am I alive? How did I love through that? Is the question. That was quick. All right. <laughs> I believe that concludes our tournament. With uh, okay, so Z better is two wins, two losses. Tasty, my boy, is zero. And Yay. Four. <laughs> I'm three and one. Trent is one and three, and Wyatt is four and zero. Oh. Congratulations, Wyatt! Oh, congrats, Wyatt! Yeah, <laughs> Hold on. Thanks. <laughs> I just picked the wrong typing. <laughs> yeah, that's that's what's hard about a tournament like this because you could just get so. Oh, look up there! Anybody want a Lucario stone? Oh, kill right. it! Oh, I've oh, got, got one. one. <laughs> I've got one as well. All right, guys, the tournament is over. I just wanted to finish the video off here because this place is fantastic we've got one two three four five zombie spawners that all spawn come right here and then we get to slaughter them to mend our tools and get coins look at how many coins we get here the coins show up right here for us to take and we just fill our inventory up my inventory is actually full so i need to put a few in here um but yeah so the tournament's over we actually lost to wyatt ah but uh in our defense he had a flying type team and we had a fight fighting type team and technically his mega was not allowed um i mean we said it was fine just because you know he put some work into making his team but mega gyarados is a uh water dark so there's that but it's really not a big deal it's just supposed to be a little fun tournament we had a lot of fun i definitely made some mistakes and wow ark and kelder missed like three rock slides like the first three moves he missed three, and that was terrible. Um, if that hadn't happened, it would have been a whole different story. Plus, I played terribly, honestly. I picked Malk Punch for Infernape, and then I couldn't switch out because I don't think I didn't think anyone could tank a hit from Togekiss, and uh, we were stuck using Mock Punch, so we didn't even kill it the second time hitting it with Mock Punch. So that was definitely a mistake on my part. I was not thinking, and then later. I should have used Drain Punch on Lucarios uh, against the Charizard whenever he was about half health because it would have done probably just enough damage to get us back up enough to enough health, enough health to survive the next attack. So that's unfortunate, but you know, what can you do? We had a lot of fun. Uh, I feel like we pretty much swept everyone else pretty easily. Um, uh, the only other person that came close to beating White was Z, cause, and uh, Z actually had a Grass-type team, so it was funny. Me and Z 
got closest to beating Wyatt, even though our two teams had like like really bad type weaknesses uh, against his. But it was a ton of fun. Uh, it was a total success. I loved uh, having everybody come over. It gave me a big incentive to work on the base. So maybe we will throw another informal tournament here in a month or so after the next turn uh, actual formal tournament that's hosted by the server. So, anyways guys, that's all I've got for this episode. I hope you enjoyed it. I really enjoyed making it, putting it together, putting this little tournament together. So, if you want to... If you liked it, please leave a like on the video, Tell me, comment what you think. If you have any ideas for buildings and stuff that we could put in our town, uh, or what we could even call our town, I don't even actually have a name for our town, leave a comment. I'd uh, really like to hear what you guys have to say. My name is Dash, and as always, thanks for watching.